favorite Raven Simone is leaving TV land for a starring role in Sister Act on Broadway. We're at Picture Ray Studios to chat with the soon to be stage star and get a first look at her transformation into a disco diva nun. been in TV land for a while. What uh, what made you want to make the leap to Broadway? This is a dream, being able to put all of the three people that I am, a dancer, singer, or actress, and be able to just put it in one and do yeah. do the thing. What I love about Dolores Van Cartier is how much of a diva she is, how much she loves herself and knows her talent and knows her worth. But I love the fact that she's insecure enough to believe in other people that they'll help her and not take it upon herself but you see her journey within the story and you see her her confidence rise with the love of her sisters and I think that it's something that I can just live in as Dolores would say I'm living she's fabulous since we we're at your sister act photo shoot I wouldn't I wanted to know if you wouldn't mind uh, ranking it where it falls in the history of your photo shoots um, this one is my favorite from your very first album. Do you want to hear about this? I do. This is, I was five years old. I can't believe that this is happening right now. There was a woman named Melissa Elliott who wrote my first song, who's now Missy Elliott. I was 18 here. This was the, the Raven Simone, this is my time, but it really wasn't because my album didn't sell at that time. Stevie Wonder wrote a song for me on this one and I went on tour with NSYNC. I had my own military tour and I was 13, so that was fun. This is how I am normally. I'm not that much of a girl. I'm such a tomboy. I love my baggy jeans since I was five. How do you imagine your, your opening night on Broadway? Tell me, tell me how this is gonna feel for you. I'm gonna be scared out of my mind. I'm gonna be like, uh, where's the curtain call? But I'm excited at the same time, but like the first five minutes of any show, I get nervous because the first five minutes of anything for me, it will set the tone for the rest of the show. So if I'm not on in that first little moment, praise him, because <laughs> I'm gonna be scared. But after that five minutes is over, I'm right in my element. You've talked a lot recently about managing your stress level and, or, and having sorted that out in your life. Are you worried at all about getting stressed out during this uh, during this Broadway run? How are you going to manage that? I'm definitely going to get stressed out. I'm, I'm worried about it, but I think that the comfortability level on the set with the cast and crew will keep that under wraps. Okay. Before I even started working with them and I saw the show, I was like, I'm going to be friends with you and you and you. You're totally somebody I went to high school. So I'm excited. I have wonderful people taking care of me and being a part of this production, if I was with any other one, I'd be scared. Let's just say that. This All has right. been a fabulous experience so far. Because you know, New York can consume you. Sure. It's a lot if you come from Atlanta or LA and they've just made it like I'm home. So it feels good. Mm -hmm.